What's up, webheads, comic book fans? Welcome back to Comic Book Corner 2.0. We're in the car. It's very dark. Yeah, so I have to use my son's cell phone <laughs> to create light so you can see our face. But we're on our way, or actually we just arrived at the theater to go see Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. We're super excited to see it. I can't wait. We're going to talk about it. Hopefully, we'll find a place that has light that we can discuss. Are you excited about this one? Yes, I am. Yes. Hopefully, it's better than Morbius. <laughs> yes, absolutely. We will be doing a spoiler-free review. So, we're going to go inside, maybe check out the movie poster. We'll see how big the line is for popcorn. So, we will be back. All right. So, here we are, the movie posters, and we are here. Bam, now showing. So excited. All right, you ready for popcorn? Yeah. Oh yeah, let's go. So we are in the theater and there is no line for popcorn in concessions. So we're just gonna walk up and get some uh, nice tasty treats. All right, Brayden, what did we get for our snacks? We got popcorn, wild cherry icy, and blue raspberry icy. Which one is your icy? Mine is blue raspberry, because it's the best. No, mine's cherry, mine's the best. No, yours is not the best, mine's Yeah, the it's best. the best. You're wrong. Well, we're still waiting for our friends. If our friends don't get here soon, we're not gonna see they're a movie. Here. Oh, they're here. They're right there coming in, so we're going in now. Later. So we just got out of the movies. We saw Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. And did this movie live up to the hype for you? Uh, yeah, pretty much. All right, yes, and absolutely this did for me as well. Guys, this was a great movie. It was very entertaining. Um, Brayden mentioned to me that Spider-Man was probably his favorite movie in a long time, and I don't think it, that topped it for him. But for me, I don't want to say that this movie topped that but this movie was very entertaining it had non-stop action i mean from the opening scene this movie had non-stop action and it had you going right from the very start do you agree yeah as as soon as the movie starts here it's immediately action yeah i mean there's very little downtime the only downtime there is is just to kind of get the plot moving but besides that, this movie had all kinds of action in it. Um, as a Marvel movie, this was a very dark movie. Uh, I did hear that this was going to be a darker toned movie. But when you're watching this movie, uh, you don't expect as dark as it's going to get. There are some <laughs> things that happen in this movie where you're just like, oh, oh. What? What? This just happens. And this has Sam Raimi written all over it. Like, if you guys know the movies and the types of, of directing that he has done, when you watch this movie, you will definitely have an understanding and the feel and the tone of this. And this was so good in that horrific feel. Um, but prepare to be shock value, uh, for sure. I think I'm going to have nightmares. Yeah, he told me that. He's like, I think I'm going to have nightmares. This is a pretty scary movie. And it, and it actually was. Um, there's definitely some things that happen in this movie that are going to make Marvel fans very happy. Uh, there's definitely all kinds of little things in here uh, that if you're a comic fan, you'll really appreciate. And um, it it was definitely a great movie. If this ranks up there in, out of all Marvel movies, where would you think this ranks? Probably, uh, I don't know. Probably just below No Way Home. Just below No Way Home. I rank it up there too. Um, you know, it's right around, like, I want to say, like, I loved Infinity War. That was my favorite movie. And then I liked Endgame. So I want to say it's like right around the Endgame area for me. Just because I love horror movies and seeing like almost the MCU horror inspired film, that's what made it for me. Okay. Um, also, let's talk about some of the characters. 
What did you think of Doctor Strange in this movie? Doctor Strange was very good. Okay. What did you think about America Chavez in this movie? America Chavez was not exactly what I expected her to be, but I still liked it anyway. Yeah, I I liked Doctor Strange. He's the way he's always been. I think he was great in this movie. Um, he definitely stood out. Uh, and America Chavez, personally, I thought she was annoying in this movie. Really? She, yeah, she was one of the characters that I really didn't enjoy. She just seemed like a sidekick character, didn't have very much to say. I don't think she really added to the movie for me. Um, I just thought she was just there as a plot device. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But as adding to the film, I didn't think she really added to it. Um, I thought Wong was really good in the movie when he was in it. Yeah, he was good. Right? I thought um, Christine was really good in this movie as well. Um, and then... But the character that made this movie was actually Scarlet Witch. She made this movie. Elizabeth Olsen made this movie the way it was. And if she was not in it, this movie would not be as good as it was. Yeah. I mean, she made everything dark happen. She just... She was the star, I think, of the entire thing. Yep. Absolutely. So, 100% perfect. Uh, and the last thing I wanted to touch on was that if you have not seen WandaVision or What If on Disney+, Plus, this movie, these shows tie into this movie uh, a lot. Now, is it a must to watch these? No, it's not. But it definitely adds to the experience, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I would recommend watching those things to get the full experience. So this movie was really good. I think it lived up to the hype. This is definitely a recommend. And I think out of uh, a star rating, I'm going to give this movie a four and a half out of five stars. I agree with that. Yeah. So really solid movie. Definitely recommend it. So, guys, that's all we have for you. We had a great time. So, as always, guys, if you like this video, you know what you got to do. I'll leave you more content right here. And until next time, this is Mike Spider Slayer signing off. Goodbye. <laughs> Take care, guys. <laughs> have a good night. Bye.